so wonderful evening friends hope things are going on fine and uh, as we enter the uh, step into the last three months of the uh, of your exam preparation here are a few uh, things which you should keep in mind or the mistake you should avoid so first thing is for example many candidates they would have doubt in mind okay it's, uh, i'll be preparing extremely hard and i'll be starting my preparation from august 1st and they may things might have not gone the way they wanted and it will be up by the time it will be august 4th or 5th they might start to panic and they'll be like i wasted 3 days 4 days kindly don't go into those kind of zones and uh, you'll you'll get you'll get, you have enough time to compensate and make up for the loss for example uh, a lot of trains they tend to go late and uh, they tend to pick up gradually and ensure they reach the station on time so apply the same logic here as well and kindly instead of asking your uh, peers who are preparing what are the targets said and in case if you are ahead of you instead of discussing these things rather than this ask them to share the topics and exchange those things because that is the only thing which will actually help you in the exam and uh, for example that that candidate is ahead of the preparation he get 60 or uh, you get 48 50 it's going to not going to make uh, much difference because as long as you cross the line that is all more important and another thing what mistakes many people do is they end up registering a lot of mock tests and all those things and they don't allocate enough time to take it and they start regretting a lot they will call their friends and they'll tell i couldn't take this i couldn't do that and in that itself they they'll be losing without their knowledge 5 to 7 days which may prove very costly at the end so kindly avoid this mistakes and uh, one more thing is be flexible in your timings for example some days uh, you might have fixed in your mind you have to go to sleep by 10 or uh, 3 am some candidates ready late night so for example if it's 3 am also you you still have the focus and the intensity try to stretch a bit at least up to 5 am don't stretch yourself too much because it will hamper the next day but don't be flexible with this as well so keep these things in mind and a lot more exciting exam oriented content related coming up so do stay tuned on watch it and make the most of it hope all of you watched the data tax case study that has been shared and uh, all the for afm and auditing videos has been shared for me don't you do as well do watch it do make the most of it all the very best be flexible uh, compare avoid comparing and uh, uh, gather as much as possible wherever uh, you could information uh, exam oriented things and stay focused all the very best uh, it's going to be a very uh, great year again for you so all the very best to you again